things that we're excited about in uh, Austin is Chef Tim Love has been to many of our festivals around the country and outside of the country, and now to be on his home turf in his home state, I'm sure he's going to bring it like he's never brought it before. Yeah, well, the great thing is about uh, what we're doing at Austin Food and Wine is for the first time we're actually doing a, a true hands-on class, uh, which is going to be, uh, for me, one of the coolest things I've ever done. We're going to have 200 people outside, each with their own grill, uh, learning how to cook a steak from starting the fire to putting the bite in your mouth. I definitely want to challenge my fans' palate, show them something new, show them something that maybe I grew up on that they have never seen or not familiar with. And if I incorporate that with some traditional food, then you have a good demo. So I usually do some uh, uh, food uh, when events make a big thing. For example, monkfish or a whole tuna. And understanding how they make their food always enhances how I make my food. So uh, to be around uh, not only some of Austin's finest, but some of Texas' finest all in one spot uh, really gets me very excited. It's like a, it's a it's like the culinary extraordinaire to have in Texas, which we've never done before. Hopefully, some of my inspiration will end up in their homes. At my demos, I'm hoping to be uh, mic'd up and going out in the crowd and actually hands-on teaching people how to do things, make sushi, roll sushi, that kind of thing. And when it's not my demos, um, I'm excited to just be part of the crowd and be part of the event and, and let people experience Austin in, in the way that I do every day. You can actually get up close and personal and you can talk to them and you can get near them and you can get their autograph and you can ask them about a recipe and they answer you and they give you advice. And I anticipate that we're all going to be walking around Austin going from one restaurant to another hotel to another music joint and you're going to rub elbows with everybody on the street. I'm really excited about Moimoto coming to Austin because um, when I first became a chef he was my idol. She said, I mean, he's an idol. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> Very ugly idol. Idol, I watched him on an Iron Chef Japan. If I remember the right, so when I when, when he's a kid, a kid a little, he, he was watching the uh, original Japanese Iron Chef. I actually battled him on Iron Chef America. I met the uh, kitchen stadium before, but uh, I didn't speak much. And so to have him come to Austin and be here as part of our festival and try his food is amazing. He said he decided to be the chef because me, you know, so that's very really honor. We all know that Morimoto is the fish king, right? But you also know that he's the karaoke king. Karaoke. Uh, only I know Japanese song. Nami no tanimani inochi no hana ga futatsu narande saite iru. I think the festival is going to challenge the palates because of all the chefs that are there and they're so competitive and they cook at all different levels and they come from different generations and they cook different kinds of food and I think the competitive spirit is really going to come out at Austin. Well, you know, going to a food festival today, there's always some type of fun competition. You know, for the fans it's fun, for us, for the chefs, we're really sweating because we might look like we're having fun, but we really want to win this competition. And what could be more fun than to do a taco competition against Michelle, Morimoto, and so many other great chefs? I'm really excited about the Rock Your Taco event because I'm excited to compete against Morimoto again. And this time I'm going to take him down. <laughs> so what's the uh, exactly taco means? Well, you know, I, the way I look at it is it's a, it's a competition, obviously. and. Um, Quite frankly, when I make tacos, I don't think anybody makes one as good as mine. So it's really not a competition, but maybe for everybody else. But, uh, you know, so it's fun to see everybody. It'll be a good camaraderie, and then when I get the medal, it'll be great. Um, is Team Love going to be there? Bring him on. See you in Austin!